Доброе утро! Всем привет! Как у вас дела? У меня замечательно. So today we're going to learn Russian words that sound the same and we write them the same, but they have different me meaning. Even the um, uh, stress is the same in these words, but they have different meaning. And we have a lot of words like that in Russian language. Homonyms. They are called homonyms. Давайте начнем. Let's begin. And the first word is number one. Number one is один. Собака. 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 What meaning of this word do you know? Write in chat. Собака. It has two meanings in Russian language. Собака. The first one is a dog, of course. A dog. A dog. And the second one is this one. This is собака in Russian language. This sign. Собака. <laughs> Uh, how do we call this sign in English? Um, like when uh, you're uh, uh, in the email, you have like Russia with Nastya. Um, I forgot, at, yeah, at, yes, at, yeah, good. Uh, number two, number two is Srida. Srida. Sri, oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Среда. 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 Do you know this word? Знаете это слово? Пишите в чате. What is среда? Среда. Mm -hmm. So, среда is Wednesday, right? Wednesday. Wednesday or what else? Wednesday or environment. 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 So Wednesday or environment. Среда. Среда. Mm -hmm. No, not middle. No. Дальше. Следующее слово. Номер три. Look. Look. What is look? Пишите в чате, write in chat. What is look? Look. So, look is an onion. Отлично. An onion. And what else? And a bow. A bow. A bow, like sport. Yeah, with... When you when they do something like that and they shoot, so this is a bow, bow, an onion or a bow. Yeah. Дальше следующее слово. The next word is мир. 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 It has two meanings as well. Uh, which one do you know? Write in chat. Мир. Мир. Мир is world. Yes. World. And peace. Peace. So, мир has two meanings. Word and peace. Мир. Мир. Дальше. Кисть. Номер пять. Кисть. Кисть. Kist is a paint brush. Paint brush. The first meeting, the first meaning is a paint brush. And the other one is not hand, is wrist. Kist. Kist. Wrist. No. Paint brush and the wrist. And wrist. Kist. Так. Mm -hmm. Дальше. 
Печь. Номер шесть. Печь. Has two meanings. One is a verb and another one is a noun. Печь. Печь means to bake, to bake, to bake and an oven. 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 Uh, for example, я пеку пироги в печи. I bake pies in the oven. Печь, to bake or an oven. Да, правильно. Дальше. Лечу. Семь. Лечу. Лечу. Uh, two different verbs in the first person conjugation. I do this. It has two meanings. Лечу. Лечу. Mm -hmm. So, лечу. I fly. I fly. I fly. Лечу. Я лечу. I fly. And I... What else? I fly and I treat. If I'm a doctor, I treat. I treat. Я лечу. I fly, I treat. Лечу. Так. Восемь. Ручка. 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 This word has two meanings as well. If you know one, please write in chat. Ручка. Ручка. Very easy word. Ручка. A pen, правильно, a pen, and a diminutive for a hand, a little hand, a little hand, hand, ручка. Usually we use it with kids, дай ручку, give me your little hand. Ручка is a hand, is hand or a little hand or a pen. Ручка, ручка, yes, a little hand, diminutive for hand. Дальше. Боксер. 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 Yo is always stressed in a word. Боксер has two meanings as well. Um, if, you're, if you speak English or your native language is English, in English we have the same situation with this word. It has two meanings, like in Russian. So, боксер. What is this? Boxer. A boxer, of course, a boxer, a fighter, a boxer. Or another word, another meaning is boxer, a dog breed. Yeah, boxer, dog breed. Don't like these dogs, they're scary. A boxer or boxer. A dog breed. Mm -hmm. Boxer in Russian. Boxer. Дальше. Very funny difference. Uh, very funny meanings of the next word. Brak. Brak. The this word has two meanings and they are totally opposite. And you will see how. Brak. What is brak? Кто знает это слово? Who knows this word? Brak. Brak. Uh, the first meaning is marriage. 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 And the second meaning, it is very funny because the second meaning is defect or a flaw. Defect. Flaw. Defect. So there are a lot of jokes in Russian language regarding these words because it means at the same time a marriage and a defect or a flaw. Yeah. Marriage, defect or a flaw. Brak. Brak. Дальше. Дворник. 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 
Dvornik. Dvornik is a very popular profession in Russian language. I don't know if you have Dvornik in your country. Dvornik. Do you know this word? Dvornik. Dvornik is a, is a uh, yard cleaner in every yard. Yes, in every yard there is this old man. Usually he is a drunk, but not always, no. Uh, but this person cleans that yard. If you are staying in a building with a lot of apartments, you have that this person that cleans uh, this yard. So he is Dvornik, a street cleaner. I found this translation in English, street cleaner. But usually this person cleans only one or two yards. Dvornik, street cleaner. Or another meaning is a windscreen wiper, wiper, wiper. Yeah, windscreen wiper. If you have a car, this thing that cleans your uh, your your uh, windscreen it is dvornik in russian dvornik so uh, windscreen screen wiper if you know another uh, name for this thing write in uh, uh, in uh, chat windshield wiper mm -hmm. okay windshield wiper yeah when it rains you will need this dvornik when outside rains and you are driving in your car you will need this dvornik to work properly mm -hmm. хорошо дальше 12 12 is disciplina disciplina Disciplina. 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 Very similar to the English word. And of course, it means discipline, where you have to obey some rules. Discipline. Discipline. Or it has another meaning in Russian language, a different meaning. And it means academic field academic field uh, or a, a branch, another branch, a branch at the university, academic field, academic field or branch, 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 not branch, branch. Mm -hmm. Yes, so it is disciplina. Trinadzite is kluč. 13 ключ ключ and of course i think that you know the most the common meaning of this word yes it's a key a key and another meaning is a spring a spring spring a spring not a season a spring um with the water that comes from underground source. This is spring, this is kluč. Yes, spring as this water that comes from underground source. Kluč, a key or a spring. Okay, дальше. Следующее слово, the next word, is ласка. 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 What is ласка? I'm not sure. God. I'm not sure if you know this word. Ласка. Ласка. What is ласка? Yes, ключ or родник. Правильно. So, ласка is tenderness. The first meaning is tenderness. 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 And the second meaning is 
an animal, a little animal that in English is called a weasel. A weasel. A weasel. Do you know this animal? Weasel. So laskins and tenderness or a weasel. If you don't know how this animal looks like, uh, Google it. Weasel. Mm -hmm. Laska in Russian language. Laska, tenderness or a weasel. Дальше, мат. 15. Мат. 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 What is mat? Mat is a filthy language or bad language, those bad words. Bad language. Language. Words. Bad words. Or another meaning is mat, mat in chess. Mat in chess. Chess game. In chess game, mat. Or bad language, mat. Mm -hmm. Yes, slang or bad language, mat. Though that filthy language. Uh, дальше. Мыш. Мыш. Like in English, has two meanings. Мыш. Мыш. So what does it mean? Мыш. Mush is a mouse, yes, mouse, an animal mouse or a computer, computer mouse, yes. So mouse, an animal or a computer mouse is mush, mush. Дальше, норка, 17, норка, норка, ударение на букву О, О is stressed, норка. Norka. Norka is uh, this small little animal, mink. Uh, mink. Mink. If you don't know how. Um, спасибо, Sterling. Спасибо большое. Thank you for supporting my channel. Norka is a mink. Uh, that little small animal that people make uh, fur coats out of this animal. Norka. A mink, da. Or another meaning is a uh, little, um, a small hole for these small animals. A hole for small animals. Small animals. It's a little hole, like for mouses, maybe for minks, for snakes. This is norka. In Russian, that whole four small animals. Дальше, 18, 18, is предлог. Предлог. Very common word. Предлог. Предлог. What is предлог? What is предлог? Mm -hmm. Предлог is excuse. The first meaning is excuse. Excuse. Or in grammar, предлог is preposition. 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 Preposition like in, at, в, на, uh, is. These are prepositions. Предлоги. Предлог in Russian language is an excuse or a preposition in grammar. Очень хорошо. Дальше предложение. 19. Предложение. 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 Mm -hmm. So, предложение is a proposal. A proposal, a proposal, or a sentence, a sentence. Предложение, a proposal, or a sentence. Молодцы. Очень хорошо. 
И еще одно слово. And one more word is Raman. This one actually has three meanings, three meanings in Russian language. 20 Raman. Raman. Do you know one of these three meanings? Write in chat. Пишите в чате. Raman. What is, who is, who is or what is Raman? Raman. Raman. Raman is a first meaning, is a novel. A novel. Novel, like a book, a novel. Raman, a novel. Another meaning is a love affair. First one is a novel. Two, a love affair. A love affair. Uh, as in у них роман. They have a love affair. У них роман. Or a novel. Роман. And the third meaning is a name. Роман is a name. A man's name in Russian language. Роман. Or short, we call, uh, we call him Roma. Roma is the short version. And the full version is Roman. Did you know this name? Mm -hmm. Yes, it is a name, Roman. So a novel, a love affair, or a name. Nice, right? Okay, mm, that's all for today. I think Roman is Romeo in English. Mm? I hope I'm not mistaken. Roman is a Romeo. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's all. Все. See you in a few moments for my next lesson. Спасибо большое. Целую вас. Пока.